the patch is here, Trogal is here, so we're gonna see a lot of four man comps, and that's why. Okay, we're just gonna leave the Trogal channel for now. Trogal. Which is which exists by the way, if you wanna try to get your hand at playing the big guy. And if I keep playing quick match enough, maybe, maybe I'll get Trogal myself. Hmm clear. There, there. We're good, we're good. Anyway, yes, that's why I decided to go with Nova. Welcome to Yours the Storm. You can do better. I'm Padinator. And Nova can erase a character, even when they're ahead now. Not sure why. Probably because of the gathering power change. Because I haven't sorted the numbers out. There's a lot of numbers, and just understanding one character's number isn't enough. You have to put it in relation to everybody else. And right now, she's looking... Well, I wouldn't say that she's tournament-worthy, but she's looking pretty sweet. Pretty fine. And... That's why I picked her. With a Cho'Gal in the... Cho'Gal is not a good target for Nova. Not at all. But... Everyone else around him is. And if you can isolate the Cho'Gal, start pressuring other lanes. Especially if you don't have a Cho'Gal on your team and you have the numerical advantage, you can start snowballing by using the... By using... Um, the numbers advantage. They just won't have enough people to cover everything. There's also less factors for you to consider, so it'll make it easier for you to start ganking. Someone's going to be forced to solo a lane with a Cho'Gal around. And with gathering power, that just means you can get to a really good position. Anyway, we're going to build around gathering power if you haven't guessed yet. And for those of you who don't know what that's all about, you can stick around. For those of you, you who do, you can click the annotation in the lower left or the link in the description below to skip straight on to the gameplay. For those of you who don't know, Nova hasn't changed that much. Um... Snipe is still snipe, big damage, don't pay no attention. The numbers are big here, but the numbers for everyone's HP has also been increased. So what annoys me about this interface is that they still haven't upgraded it. Despite all the things they've upgraded, they've upgraded everything in game, which I guess is where they want the focus to be, but they have not upgraded our information outside the game. So I guess they just want to force us to play the game to get to know things. I can understand that from a marketing standpoint. I can't understand that from a reasonable human being standpoint but anyway snipe deals damage to the first enemy hit one of the biggest single target abilities in the game extremely effective more so now because the squishies got squishier the tough guys got tankier scaling has been changed to four percent of uh four percent per level it's all it's multiplicative now so bigger changes in the end game basically and respawn times respawn timers are much longer especially and not especially just for levels 1 to 10. That's what they want to do. Make the early game less impactful in terms of snowball, more impactful in terms of deaths. And Snipe's going to be your killer ability. You hit someone with this, they're either going to back or they're going to die. Either way, we're not snoking a lane for a while. Pitting shots slows and damages an enemy. Good for a setup with Snipe. It is not a skill shot. It's a targeted ability. Holo decoy. This is what you use to put the fear Gundam. And as a stealthy, that's your primary objective if you're if they're not shooting at your clones by the, by the end of the game you're not doing your job very well they must fear you they must think that they have no choice if it's the real you they gotta take the chance and if it's not well you win either way they're spending something on it or they're thinking about it give them too much to think about permanent cloak sniper permanent cloak means that she's in stealth she does leave a shimmer, so you can't see it if you pay enough attention or are used to playing against her enough. Taking damage, attacking, using abilities, or channeling reveals you. Basic attack range is 20% further than other ranged heroes, and you see 10% further, making you an excellent scout. Most of the time, you're probably not going to be with the team. You just have to make sure that you're going to be a moving ward with a gun. If you see a good pick, you take it. If you don't, you just tell the team, hey, this is happening now. Move on to the day. Triple tap. Not much has changed. Locks onto a hero, fires three shots, deals a lot of damage. Precision Strike, Global Ability, Nukes and Area. Talents. Okay, this this was a weird match. Because of the way we were positioned, I didn't think we had the clear. And clear is still important. Sorry, I took a sip of my coffee. The clear is still very, very important. We had an Artanis, a Tychus, a Troga, and myself. That's why I did what I did. I need to preface this. Because I'm not sure I did the right thing. It, it's what felt like the right thing, what's numerically felt the right thing, but tactically it might not have been the best option. Level 1, I picked up Ambush Snipe. Increased Snipe damage while cloaked. Increased Snipe's damage with 20% we used for cloaked or within 1 second of being cloaked. Since Gathering Power is going to increase our ability damage, I thought it best to 
well, focus on that and bandage. Make us, make it, give us a one big snipe. Uh, Conjurer's Pursuit, you're not really gonna have that many mana issues. Level 4! Gathering power. Takedowns, increase ability power. If it's used to cap at 15%, but now that it caps at 30, it's actually pretty deadly. Here it takes that takedowns, increase ability power by 2% to a maximum of 30%. Unfortunately, this bonus ability power is lost in death. I would only really recommend taking Gathering power if they don't have anything that can reveal you easily, such as Tassadar's trait, Oracle, or somebody with Clairvoyance, a word that I apparently forgot throughout the game. Unfortunately, it's on the same level as in Venom. And Venom is probably what I'd pick if they had the Tacit or anyone that can reveal us without our consent. Because staying safe is no longer reliant as reliant on your play. It They can negate your advantage by being who they are, and that's not great. Level 7! Okay. The, the picks here, there are really two picks here. One in the chamber or at the armor shells. I picked neither. I went with explosive round. Because of our team composition, Artanis, Tychus, and Chogal, I did not feel that we were we would be able to cover the lanes sufficiently, and sometimes you're doing nothing but scouting as a Nova. And while that's important, careful play from your team sometimes negates the need for that. So what do you do? You start laning, you start trying to push lanes, but without explosive round, you don't have a laning presence. You're just going to hit things very, very slowly or spend too much mana to get rid of one or two minions. This makes you slightly more efficient. I'm controversial, controversial is the wrong term for this choice, but that's the closest word that comes up to mind. I picked it. I wanted to clear more, and that was the theory. I <laughs> need you to remember that that was the theory. Also, important to note. I could still pretty much kill whoever I wanted. If they were at half health or quarter health, they were in trouble. Possibly because of the new scaling changes to damage. So, this made one in the chamber and anti armor shells while making you better at your job. Your primary objective is to kill. It doesn't necessarily make you worse of a character anymore. They're not as mandatory, and that is an excellent sign. That's mandatory is a bad word when you're looking for diversity. Level 10, we've discussed the heroics. Level 13, Holo Decoy deals damage. That's what I'm gonna stick to. Holo Decoy deals 25% of Nova's damage. Not only will this confuse people but because your clones now deal damage, possibly provoke them into attacking you. It's good for finishing off somebody, and it actually stacks with your gathering power. It also applies the slow from your W, from your pinning shot, so it's all good. Other choices here. Headshot, well, if you're greedy or if they really have a lot of squishies or if you have the level advantage, this may let you snowball into a victory. Yes, it's a little win more, but I prefer to think of... Win more is such a bad term for it. It is... It's inaccurate. Win more, it's better described as... Great when you're ahead. Because it doesn't guarantee the win. But it can secure it. Which I guess is not a guarantee, but secure it, but help secure it, because this will allow you to keep people from actually interacting with the fight. But it's up to you whoever, which one you want to pick. Spell Shield is actually a good option, considering Chogal and Chogal's numbers are crazy, but there you go. Level 16! I'll, I would have picked Railgun. I really would have, but we were fighting a Chogal, so I went with Crippling Shot to increase the damage taken by our enemies. There you go. Make it worth it. We needed to kill them fast and the team seemed coordinated enough to focus down one guy whenever possible, so this was a good option. Double fake is also good. Railgun, if neither seem applicable. Railgun, if you need to lane. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm saying that, but I felt the need for it. That I, Anyway, I'll, I'll stop talking about that. Level 20. A lot of good options here, actually, except for fast reload. Depending really on what you're fighting, fast reload is situation. It's cool. It's really cool. I want to make it work, but it's not. It wasn't a good choice because they had to choke out. No. Lyric precision barrage is good. Gives you a lot of reach. Gives you a way to hurt somebody. You precision barrage against them. They turn around, put it behind them. There's a delay between each of the shots, but that's only fair. Um, rewind. Let's do reset the cooldown of your basic abilities. Always good. More snipes is better. Might actually be ideal with gathering power. Bolt of the storm if you want safety and your aggression is working out fine. I've reduced the team composition because of an advantage. Anyway, here are the matchups. We're on Garden of Terror. 
the new scaling changes, they've, they made me feel strong. Stronger. They made me feel more assassinated, and I feel that's the direction they want to go. Which is funny, because one of my fears was that all the characters would seem samey after a while. And despite, you know, um, despite all evidence to the contrary, because different hero concepts, etc., etc. But this made me feel more in role. Which may be what they wanted. Yeah, I know the matchups are weird, but we got a tank, so I was happy. It was, it's an okay setup, even though not every team had the support. Well, without further ado, let's get straight on to the gameplay. Well, considering the setup and both teams have a Cho and a Gull, I'm gonna be the Wanderer. I'm a wander, 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 wander. Well, I'm the kind of guy who will never settle down. Gonna look for squishies, gonna blow them up today. I hope the other team isn't looking to gank. Because that's really bad. <laughs> I need playing dominance. Oh no. Oh, they are not a good place for us to be. Let's see. Not a good place for us to be. Alright, let's see if Leoric pushes on Tychus. No, Leoric got nerfed. That's okay. But I don't know how much of a nerf it will be considering. Oh, jeez. You got a really thick health bar. Can't wander into that. Maybe Falstad. Maybe, maybe uh, not Falstad. Maybe this guy. Oh, we got him. Oh, we sniped him. Oh, we're going to pick up uh, Gathering Power because none of them have a real way to reveal our stealthiness. That's going to be safe. Let's go over to mid. Okay, our Cho'Gal is getting shot down. Not a good target, but at least we got him. We poked him out. Okay. Well, we're going to have to stay in lane now. The question is, do I want to go with Gathering Power or do I want to go with lane? Laning may be... And we can do that by picking up the pierce on our snipe. And the answer may surprise you. Because they can't really counter us. Man, that's going to be hard to chunk down. Actually, it's going to be impossible to chunk down. Okay. I will hang around here. Actually, no. Yeah, let's clear that lane. Gotta keep an eye out for our guys. I mean, everything is new, so why not pick up Nova? Well, we poked him. Do we have anyone that deals percentage-based damage? Not sure. Uh, doesn't look like it. Alright, let's turn around. Drop back into stealth. I will drop this here because they expect us to be their mind games. We're playing Nova. We're playing mind games. Oh, dang. Okay, we got him. We got him. I thought he managed to actually escape, which would have been tragic. All we can really do is start poking down their softies. And this is going to be very, very tasty. I want to get my first Cho'Gal kill. Well, I'll take a Leoric. Since we can't chunk down Cho'Gal, we're going to have to... Oh! Jeez, that's annoying. Gathering power? Gathering power, I think. We're getting the snipes we want. So that's what we're going to go to. Let's see. Hey, get away, get away. I'm going to scout for the team. And my team is soaking much more efficiently than we are. So I don't know how well this is going to go. A lot of problems coming up here. Acknowledged. Hmm. And the good news is we can still pick up the big snipe. Uh, so that should work out. I'm going to clear this lane. The enemy team is soaking, so I have to counter soak. Not the best use of our Nova. Granted. But they aren't soaking this lane either. So I'll take it. Let's see. I'm going to go peek over here. See if they are getting busy. The answer may surprise you. I know this is bad. Uh, we missed. He moved out of the way. I couldn't get an angle. The, the pathing was weird. That might have been me. That might have been the way this is all working out. But the good news is neither team has a Garden of Terror. I mean, a Terror at all. Did they try to poke us with that? I saw it. Okay, we got the Illidan. The Illidan is dying a lot. That's a good sign. The more, the bigger level advantage we have, the more stressed it'll be. I know that the new changes were designed to keep that from happening. But hey. It's a Nova. <laughs> it's still gonna... I don't know what I'm saying. Honestly, I'm just thinking about... What the... What happened? Strictly uh, do we want to lean against a false dad? This is actually really bad for us. I'm just gonna poke him. And it's a really ineffective poke. But it's there. And it, I wanted to poke. Bad news is we have bruiser ta camps up top. I don't know how to defend that. Here's the problem. Do we want explosive round or not? 
I feel like the answer may surprise us all. Oh, we got him with a slow. Hopefully our Tychus can... Oh, okay, we didn't need to do that. I was hoping that the Tychus could finish it off, and if the Tychus finished it off, so I'm feeling very good. Still not sure what to take. One in the chamber, maybe? I like focus, but we don't have the laning presence we may need to make all of this work. Lord forgive me, I'm picking explosive round. Lord forgive me. I mean, gathering power buff got buffed to a maximum of 30%, so that could be extremely good for us. What the? Is that a Chogal ability? Cho. Oh, Chogal body blocked our, our snipe, which isn't great. I'm gonna go hunt that Illidan down. In a fit of irony, that's what I'm gonna do. Danger. Uh, I'm gonna hide over here. This is a very dubious position for us to be in. Ah, uh, we missed the snipe. Well, he body blocked. It's fine. Time to go, Art. They're jungling way better than we are, which isn't great. I think we're doing fine. The unfortunate part is we have no stacks in our gathering power. I'll make it happen. Well, we have one stack in our gathering power. It still isn't great. Not a lot of ganks to be had, and I'm not sure where... Oh, they're probably in our jungle. I can't see them. Okay, they're not there. That's good. And we've caught up to them in terms of experience six minutes into the game. Let's see if we can get this choke out. No, we can't. Man, the rotations are going to be weird with four people in the game. Not a good time to play Abifer, honestly. No, not going to snipe that. Uh, nope. Get out of that. I picked explosive shot to lane, but I'm not doing a lot of laning. Ow, oh, that's terrible. Let's do this. Oh, Illidan. Oh, Illidan, I'll get to you. I wonder if triple tap is a better idea. You know, 500 damage, 1,500. All that means is we can chunk down someone from level 1, which isn't great. Because you're level 10, they're level 1, and that's impossible. Uh, do you. Yeah, we got him. <laughs> I'm enjoying myself. Not because I only picked... Oh, let's not do that. I only picked gathering power because none of them have... I want to say not cleanse. Uh, clear clairvoyance. None of them have clairvoyance. They don't have a tassadar, which means I can play safe. The option to win... The pressure to live is on me. Not... Well, yes, it's always on me. But they don't have a way to force me into sight until I choose to be inside. That's good, that's good. We're getting a lot of kills. A lot of okay, and we while the takedown uh, the takedown stat is gone. I just want to clear the lane faster. While the takedown stat is gone, I think as long as we participate, we're gonna get stacks. See, we haven't gotten a personal kill. Oh no, it's we haven't gotten an assist. No! It's still takedown, so that's not great. That's not good. This isn't working the way I intended at all. Well, goodbye, Leoric. I mean, it's not working the way I intended, but it's working very well so far. Okay, we've got terror and terror action. Not sure where I want to go. Well, I want to go where the Illidan is. I want to go where the wild things are and make them pay for it. Uh, I want him to jump on the terror. If he jumps on the terror, we'll be in a good spot. Unfortunately, we've taken the experience lead. Okay, I'm just going to lurk around here, see if we can get an opportunity shot. Uh, that's not great. I know, this isn't great either. This is probably gonna kill us. But I needed to kill that. Chogal is here. Enemy Chogal is in bot. I hear rather, I saw the bounce. Because our Chogal... Where is our Chogal? There's our Chogal. Oh, then that might have been ours. I will just lurk around here. See what we can do. We need the faster clear. That's why I picked Explosive Shot. No, bad Chogal. No sniping for you. No snipey snipes. Bad sniper, no sniping. Let's see. We're just chasing this guy down. No opportunity targets. That's fine. This guy's probably gonna get... Hey. You're tough, but you're not invincible. I wonder if he counts for two. Uh, I want him. I want him. Big bomb. Big boom. Big boom. Okay, we gotta get out of here. Yeah, okay. I'm starting to rethink my choice of explosive shot. And, well, that's just life, I guess. 
Hollow Lethal Decoy. Should synergize well with our gathering power. We got 8% bonus power. That's great. Uh, health is not the best. I'm just going to stay here so we can... I wanted that lane. That does not deal as much damage as I hoped. But still good. We're not missing out on a lot. Honestly. Except for anti-armor shells. That could have been amazing. Yeah, they're here. <laughs> Just checking. Hey, Falstad. How's your life been? Well, you're at half-life now, so I guess not great. Okay, we got that first. We're gonna have to go down to bot. They still have enough seeds on the field to actually make another garden tower, which could be very tragic for us. Oh, look, the towers have changed. They're like, they, they show you how much life they have. Uh, well, that was a mistake for the York and giving us another stack. Okay, assists count. That's great. That's good. Uh, no. Oh, no. Uh, no. Uh, yes. No? Alright. Didn't get the hit. But we can get the false stat if we so desire. Stuff up. I'm gonna be over here. False stat, false stat. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, he's back. Well, I played a little too carefully there. We could have gotten another false stat for our trouble, but I will defend this first. There's a reason I picked that ability and for this specific purpose. Why didn't I pick the follow up, follow through snipe? Because it's at level 16. And it's where crippling shot is. So, this plan went south really fast. Okay, we got this, we got this. Okay. All of my regret. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I don't know why I gotta make a big deal of this. Okay, this is not a good engagement. Okay, we can get the Chogal. Uh, don't have enough mana for our... Be gone. Pay no attention to me. Help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. No! Our stacks! Ah, uh, it was up, uh, up to me. I wanted to get the false stat kill, but that's not great. Good news is we only died once. The bad news is we died pretty late into the game, so I don't know how quickly we can regain our stacks. I think we just need to be present at many, many, many fights. Oh, that was painful. That was painful. See, gathering power got increased to 30%. Oh, the thing is we're not getting all that many kills to begin with. <sighs> well, my entire plan just went to... Heck in a handbasket. I will actually pick pinning sh Crippling Shot. Uh, to increase all damage done to the target because of all the high HP guys they have on the team. And the team seems to be a little focused, so that's going to work out for us. Only died once, but we haven't secured a lot of kills. Chogal doing a lot, you know, a mess of damage. Uh, that's not great. We have the terror, and we don't. Uh, oh, come on, Pat. Thank you. Uh, no need for that. I'm gonna wait for Illidan to reveal himself. Uh, hmm. If Liara could come in closer, I would have chunked him. Let's see. I'm moving to bot. We've lost two. Forest, they've lost one. Not great. Just gonna drop that Hollow Decoy over there. We're not gonna be able to do much with our Hollow Decoys. Let's see. Oh, we hit Illidan. But that's a weird spot for it. I mean, that's not gonna do much. Let's see. They are not too down. Terror is about to die. Let's roll with the team. I think we should stick with the team. One, it'll let us gather more stacks. Hey, Chogal. What's up, buddy? Uh, Leoric? Well, we can yank him. He's desperately out of position. Hey, 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 we gotta go. <laughs> yeah, because they're all gonna be dead. I'm just gonna drop this here because I can. Leoric walked into everything we could ever throw at him and hope to love and joy, give him the cripple. 
let the beam sort all of this out. Our Cho'Gal is down. That's two people. That's basically a 2-2 loss, which isn't great because they still have their Cho'Gal. I will... Man, that did not work out the way I expected it to. But I think we can still make it. We have a slight level, heat of, uh, level lead ahead of us. Well, yes, if they had a slight level lead, they'd be ahead of us. That's just how language works. Just wanted to clear faster, man. No need to take the, la to take the last hits. All we need to do is weaken things enough so that we can do this. Should be more in front. I will scout for us, but I feel like they're actually at top because those seeds are gone. Let's see what's over here. They are not on top. This is Lyric all alone. I will move over here. Snipes. Snipes. I think we can get this without me dropping the bomb. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. That Lyric is losing the game for them. I think we gotta rely on that. Thank you, quick match fun. That's just life in quick match, man. Okay, we got four stacks. That's okay. That is an 8% increase. Okay, got a scout for the team now. <clears throat> Unfortunately, we have another terror incoming. And they're on their way. Nope, no bones about it. They're on their way. Hmm. Okay, we got the seeds at least. We didn't get enough. That's tragic. Uh, we're gonna have to defend. It's gonna have to be a good defense. This could be the game if we screw up. But I don't think it will be. The team has been playing well so far. Just didn't drop that. Clear the wave. Clear the wave, man. Okay. Tychus can handle that by himself. I will tap the well for a quick burst of mana. I don't want to leave the fight too long. But that may have been a bad decision considering Chogal is probably going to get this camp easily. But I want to help. Because that's what Novas do. We help. We're helpers. They're willing to die for the cause and I'm willing to kill for it. That's... That is our manifesto now. And manifesto gets such a bad rap for, you know, thank you, Unabomber, for ruining things for everybody. Gonna go scout. Uh, gonna go throw that out there. Slow them yeah, down. Like hmm. Not good. We're not mounted. Let's mount up. And we need to get an opportunity shot on somebody. That's not gonna be it. That's not gonna be it either. That's not a good choice. Honestly, neither is that. But we zoned them out. We gotta get out. We gotta get out. Okay, we're visible. We're visible. We can be seen. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. Well, the Illidan might die, and so might we. I chased him off. That's good. Uh, far from the end, guys. Why are you, why are you chilling? Oh, you're healing. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, where's their Illidan? See if we can chase away their Falstad, get a good snipe on him. Goodbye, Falstad. Goodbye. Precision Barrage, let's get the snipes on. Hmm. I'll mount up, they can see me. No, he's not low enough for a big old snipe. I will wait for that to die, then we'll hit him with everything we've got. Oh, we missed the snipe. We gotta go. This is a mess. Let's drop the bombs. Goodbye, Leoric. Goodbye, Choke. What the heck are those? Oh, I'm gonna back because three, four of them are dead. Only Illidan is alive. And I think if he dives on us, the team is near enough to make this all kind of okay. Oh, yay. 18 minutes in and we're gonna get value off our explosive shot. Ooh. I mean, explosive round. Kind of. I know, it's not an efficient use of it. But we have to lane. This is giving us the little push we may need to get back into this. And fortunately, Falstad is back up. Yeah, only the respawns for 1 to 10 have been changed later on. It's basically the same game. Even in terms of scaling, actually. It's really the early game where things change. Well, we've got a lot of assists. We're support Nova now. That's going to be a thing. I like to think. Their Trogal is still down. That's still two guys on their team who are not going to work very well. Big snipes. Hmm. Well, <laughs> we're clearing better than Cho. Oh, Gal's doing very well, though. They're going to be looking for us. No, no question about that. We got... We secured a number of kills. 
I do I want to be here? I want to stick with the team. Okay, okay, third bot. Time to keep an eye out on bot. Uh, hey guys, what's going on here? Oh, Jesus Christ! Take it easy. What does he owe you money? And even if he did owe you money, you shouldn't be punching him in the face. Okay, I'm really probably gonna be popping up here. I should probably get terror. Hmm. is getting terror? Nerds! Should probably be me. Oh no, this this could be it. Our Trogal has just overextended. Yeah, that's it. That's that's done. Do you got a problem? They can push to core if they so desire, which isn't great. But I think we've been doing well personally. You know, getting used to the new system. The early game damage is not ours now. Okay, let's take care of that siege camp. This is why we picked the shot. And I think it hasn't really affected our killing power all that much. Only once has people really been able to escape us. And that's okay. That's I'll take those numbers. Okay, we're terrorists coming up the top. Oh, we got value out of that. We're going to have to treat it like Zagara's Bailing Barrage. Okay. We can still make it. We can still make this work. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm choking on my own fear here. Let's see. Do you think I'm stupid? Not you. Don't 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 answer that. Cho can still use abilities in the terror. How is that okay? Okay, that makes sense. Actually, it's less crippling. I'll just snipe it. Ow, Jesus! Yeah, I know. Wow, I'm really soft now. Okay. Well, we've got the friends. Uh, we're gonna get sniped. We're gonna get sniped really hard. And so are you. You missed. You missed. That's so embarrassing. You missed. Well, if he wants to die, we can oblige him. Run. Or not. I'll, either way. I care not which you choose, only that I win from it. Really, Edithin? Really? You're gonna give us the win? Just like that? Sorry, I don't mean to be a jerk, but what were they doing? They're down at Trogal. Oh, that's gonna be good. I hope he stays. Loud and clear. I hope he backs. I hope he's not backing yet. See here? The hunt is on. Because we have a Dayork and a False Dayork, and nah, the hunt is not on. Unless he's trying to... No, he wouldn't. That's crazy. That's crazy talk, that. Uh, let's get a good angle on this. There we go. You now, there's an argument to be made that I did exactly the wrong thing by picking explosive shot, and you may be right. But it is what it is. It's what we've chosen. We've got to live with it, and we've got to deal with it, and we've got to use it as much as possible, or we just literally wasted the talent. Okay, we don't have a terror. I will help with this. Because we need it. Man, that line, I thought that there was something there. But it's just their ability bouncing. Okay, we've got terrors. Unfortunately, the enemy team is also up, but we can create pressure using this. I will start scouting for the team. Don't know what that ball does. I mean, I've seen videos of Cho'Gal, but that's about it. They are at top. I'm going to see if they're going to try to sneak this. No, they're not. Oh, goodness. This is, a t this is pretty intense. I like it. A lot of close games. Gonna. We're not here. Are they? Oh, that's Illidan. Ah, just run. Just run, man. Just, just, let's not even get into this. Ah, I'd love to oppose the siege camps and the bruiser camps, but... I need to keep the team safe. No, that's fine. That's fine. Oh, well, that's not as fine. They're here, they're here. That's honest, I think. Stasis? Well, goodbye, Trogal. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. I tried. I tried. Well, I gotta pick it up now, because... 
Everybody's dead. Acknowledged. I am a garden terror. This may be the end. Kill who you can. Kill who you can. Kill the Illidan. Kill the Illidan. Kill the Illidan. Oh no, our car is going to go down. Anyway, ah, uh, that's unfortunate. Thanks for watching. I saw. I hope you still enjoyed the video. It's it's. I think it was a good example of the changes we're going to experience in this patch. It's it's good stuff, really. Um, tougher early game, less snowball -y, more competitive overall. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more Heroes of the Storm and other games, you can subscribe to... Yeah, I'm on the Chogal channel. Look at that thing. Look at that spam. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed that and you want to see more Heroes of the Storm, you can subscribe to the Dark Fluffy Cloud channel so you don't miss a thing. I'm Padnator. I'll see you later.